It all starts with hard work for any team, whether they're facing a season, a practice, a game, or every shift. And the CHL, through a poll, has recognized the Mallards as the hardest working team in the league. And certainly all that starts with the man voted the best coach in the league, Terry Ruskowski. For us to be successful, we have to work hard. We have no superstars in this team and everybody's got to pitch in and do their thing. So working hard is something that I'm very proud of that the guys, the team won because um, they, they have worked hard. We may not be the most talented team, but obviously we work very hard and when we work hard, good things happen for us. How do you grow that with, with a team? Well, you keep on working hard. You keep on working hard and you put in different plays and see if it'll work and our passing has got to be, got to be good. If we don't pass well, we don't play well. So we really concentrate on our passing. The other thing is defensive coverage. We've gotten better the last couple of days or games, I should say, and we have to continue to play a really good defensive game because we play against top-notch top notch teams. Uh, they're going to get opportunities, and, and we make sure we have to be there to, to stop them. I think we take pride in uh, coming to the rink every day and working hard, so uh, that's a good thing for sure. We can keep that up. It's going to be huge in the playoffs. What kind of results do you get because you're that kind of team? I think uh, just everyone works together, and we feed off each other. Everyone wants to do it for each other, so... Hope we can keep on doing that. And now as the Mallards look to finish the regular season strong and move into the playoffs, the coach says use that hard work to create opportunities to make a deep run in the playoffs. We just got to do a little soul check, soul searching and uh, maybe say a couple more prayers here and there would help <laughs> a lot too. I mean, I do mind you by the way, but you know, you look down in your soul. Some guys think they're playing hard and they're actually not and you got to tell them that they're not and you got to show them that they're not on the video. So they've got to know that if you work hard, good things happen. If you do things right, good things will happen for you too. So, uh, you know, that's just kind of the bottom line. We've got to work hard. We've got to execute our game plan. If we do that, we have a chance to win. And if we don't, we're struggling to win. Playoffs is a whole different game. I think it's, if you're not working hard, you don't stand a chance. So it's a battle every night and we just got to be a work hard on the other team and hopefully uh, bounces go our way. That really starts at the top too. I mean, uh, your, your coach obviously is that kind of guy. Yeah, for sure. You know. Uh, He's, he's been around hockey for a long time. He's, he's won. He knows what to do. So uh, well, we can all just work together and find a way to get it done. I hope you can join us for a couple of great events we've got coming up. On April 10th, it's the Illawa FCA Night of Champions. We will hand out our Scholar Athlete Awards and have our Hall of Faith inductee. Then on May 10th, it's our annual sporting clay shoot. Just a great, great time. With this week's FCA Story of the Week, I'm Dan Pearson.